Hey everyone, welcome back to another video. I hope you guys are all having a wonderful Monday. Today we're going to be talking a little bit about some of my baby crested geckos and how they have been doing over the last couple months here. Today we're going to be also weighing the three ones that I weighed back in June. Now all these geckos are only about a day apart in age. They all hatched around the exact same time. Uh, some are from Fallen King and some are from Ottoman King. Uh, but I want to see how they have been growing here over the last couple months in the summertime. If you remember back to the video I made in June, they were all 2.5 grams back then, and we're going to be seeing how they have grown today. Generally speaking, it's somewhere between about 75 and 78 in my house. Uh, they also get crickets once a week. Uh, whether or not they eat the crickets, though, it really depends on the baby. This one here is my first baby that hatched April 27th out of Ottoman King. Doesn't like the crickets as much as the other ones, as you'll see, um, but a very pretty little Halloween nonetheless. So we're going to see how much this little one weighs. Hopefully some growth, more than 2.5 grams would be good because obviously that means then he's been growing and you can obviously tell he's been growing too just by how big he is. As you can see, he's mostly on the scale. Uh, his tail's just touching a little bit and it said 2.8 grams, he jumped off. Now I should also mention the fact that today or last night was not feeding night. He hasn't eaten in a day, which means that his weight might be a little bit less than what it would normally be. Uh, depending on how much he pooped and things like that but 2.8 grams is still gross so that's good i wish he was growing a little bit faster but that's okay uh, and this is the first baby like i said but let's move on to baby number two baby number two here is out of fall and king also developing nicely as you can see if it'll focus beautiful little gecko lots of bright orange uh, probably getting that from fall you can see though that it's a little bit hard to weigh some of these geckos when they're so jumpy like this so we're gonna have to try and make this quick. You can see that her one foot is a little bit off and her tail is hanging off, but that doesn't really matter. Uh, and 3.5 grams, so that means a whole gram in the last month or so. That's good growth. I wish the other baby was doing this well. Um, but you can see, definitely growing. This one likes the crickets more than the last one, so that's good. But I'm happy with the growth on this one. And we're gonna move on to the last one today, which is the clutch mate to this one. This one was born on 428, so a day after the other one, and then the one after this is a day after. So nice little gecko. This one is also available. So if you're looking for a nice little baby tricolor in the making, this is for you. Beautiful little gecko. Now this little guy here is one of my favorites from Fall and King so far. Uh, I think this guy is going to develop to be an awesome little gecko. I'm undecided whether or not I'm going to have this one available or not. Um, but you can see how much this one likes the crickets compared to the other two. Uh, let's just gently set them on there. And even with the feeding, not feeding them, um, last night, you can tell that this is going to be a big boy. Okay, so as you can see, this one is also just a little bit off, but not by much. So let's just say it's 4.2 grams. So this one's put on almost 2 grams in the last month, which is like a lot more than the first one that we weighed. Um, but you can see that this one definitely likes crickets even more than... The other two last ones and is growing quite well um, these little babies are so funny because they're so feisty um, but i thought it was pretty interesting at the different rates that these guys are growing at uh, with the one being just a couple points of a gram the other one being about one gram and then this little guy being about two grams you can see that all the little geckos are different and it'll be interesting to see where these guys end up in a couple months from now or a year from now depending on which ones i hold on to i'll be making a proper update video on all the babies that i have pretty soon um, just because I have more than 10 now, I actually have 12 babies. So there's lots of little babies to show you guys. Uh, and lots of little beautiful geckos are hatching out here. So be on the lookout for that. Anyway, thank you so much for watching. And I hope to see you in next week's video.